and welcome back to my channel it's been so long since i have posted a video or spoken to y'all but you all know the reason i am doing my internship and i am super busy but today i have got my weekend off after like a month today i have so many plans and so many things to do well not so many things but a few things to do and i'm gonna take you with me so let's get going hello everyone so today is the 31st of march and this is my outfit for the day before we head out let's get our stomachs full with the milk rice that my mother has made hi smile Smile. That was my little niece. You've met her in the Malaysian vlog. She was not in a good mood that morning anyway. Um, so here we are headed to our first destination. Keep watching to find out where we are headed to. Okay, so now we have come to our first stop and that is the temple. I have been wanting to go to the temple ever since I got my weekend offs. Um, but I couldn't do it last week. So I'm finally doing it this time. I'm super excited. So let's get going. The temple is one of the top three places that I go to if I want to calm myself down. Whenever I step into the temple, the silence really calms me down like lets me know that i am safe and i'm in peace here i am arranging the flowers that my mother plucked for me Out of everything we do, apart from praying of course, uh, this is my favorite thing to do that is to light up the lamps and light up the incense sticks. After getting everything done, I decided to go inside the Buddha to spend some time with myself, to be in silence and to recollect my thoughts. Also, can we take a moment and appreciate these drawings, how beautiful they are. Okay, back to chaos and reality. <laughs> now the calmness is gone and my mind is now back into the stress of, you know, life. Keep watching to get to know what we are gonna do next. Okay, so now we are headed to get some things done. I have to first go and see whether this shop is open. If so, I can go and shop and then go do my eyebrows and then go and eat. That would be ideal so let's first go and see if this shop is open <laughs> all right so i went to both the shops that i wanted to go to but i did not find anything that i liked um so i didn't buy anything um so i'm gonna go do my eyebrows now and then go and eat and then get back home today is my sister's birthday so i don't know i haven't bought a gift for her yet I don't know what to buy actually but let's see if I can find something. I'm still thinking what to get. I know it's like really late uh, but I'm still thinking. Let's see. I got my eyebrows done. Now I have to still think of something to get for my sister. Okay, let's do this. I will first go and have something to eat and then I'll think of the present. 
I'm super excited because I have been craving this thing that I'm gonna eat for the past five, six days. So let's go and eat it. Good news, I got my sister's birthday gift. Let me show you all. Yay! It's the ultimate food ritual uh, from Spa Salon. I thought that this was the best for her because she is taking care of her babies all throughout the year and she doesn't get a day to take care of herself. So here's her chance to take care of herself. Uh, this is like I think one and a half hours. So she gets one and a half hours to take care of herself. I'm gonna write her wish now. Oh, by the way, uh, I came to eat and that place is closed and it opens at 11. So I have to stay, I have to kill time until 11 o'clock. Um, so let's do that together. <laughs> So here's my wish. Uh, I said happiest of birthdays, birds. Since you're only taking care of your babies, here's your chance to take care of yourself. Enjoy. It's a small gift, but I hope she enjoys it. Alright, so since I had to kill time, I came to Kiehl's uh, and I bought my juice. Uh, anyway, like uh, the juice there will be expensive. I anyway wanted to get a lime juice. So since uh, it's going to be expensive and I'm thirsty, it's super hot now. Uh, I saved myself a thousand rupees and I got this for 140 rupees. And then I remembered my mother who loves Faluda. Uh, so I was gonna buy the Faluda drink that they had already made but it was 280 or something and I thought what about the mix the mix of 200 grams was 260 rupees so I bought that so that we can all make it and drink it <laughs> so that is that let me drink this mm. so refreshing I was trying to vlog inside the keels and everyone kept looking at me so I stopped. We have around 5 minutes to kill. Uh, I'm gonna switch on this thing because I am sweating. Mm. Okay, let's get going. I don't understand how people vlog inside cars because I there's no place to keep this phone and it keeps falling. Oh god, the problems. Finally, the restaurant is open and here I am. Just look at this interior. It's so aesthetic. The pink tables are my favorite. Let's just all pretend to look at the menu and choose what I want and I actually know what I want. Um, I have pre-decided what I'm gonna get because I've been craving it for the past 5-6 days. Um, but yeah, after giving the order, I just spent some time with myself just thinking about the past couple of months, how internship has been going and how I've been facing new things every day when my food came and I forgot all of that and started eating and oh my god just look at my face when I had that first bite. I don't think I was able to show 100% of my expressions there but y'all know that little smile means I am dancing inside because my craving is 100% satisfied. out alone everything just gives me a sense of freedom a sense of uh, independence you should try it if you haven't let's see how my sister is gonna react when I give her the present I'll see you all with that happy birthday
And that was my sister's reaction to the gift I gave her. If she is happy, I am happy. Anyway, here I am arranging the flowers that my brother-in-law has gifted my sister. A birthday will always call for a celebration at our place. So here my mother has made some cutlets and this cake was gifted to my sister by our big sister. And now it's time to light up the candles and sing happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear boys. Happy birthday to you. Like I said before, if there's anything that we can celebrate, a little win, a small achievement, a little promotion, a birthday, beat anything, uh, we will make sure to celebrate it at least by going for a dinner or bringing in some food and eating it together. By doing that, I think what it uh, strengthens is the family bond that we have. It makes us closer and it strengthens the fact that we have a family to fall back to, that we have people that have our backs. And I think that is really important for a person to feel safe. All right, with all the talking, I have forgotten that we have come to the end of this video. I really, really hope you enjoyed it. Until I see you in another video. Bye.